if you want to know that how you can generate a Google form quiz with one single click without copying and pasting the questions and options from ChatGPT into the Google form, then this video is for you. I'm going to tell you in this video, once you have generated some questions on a specific topic in Google Form, in ChatGPT, or any AI tool of your choice, then how you can transform those questions directly into a Google Form. And trust me, this will save your time because as a teacher, it saves my time a lot. So let's get started. So the first thing first, for example, I will give the prompt to generate some multiple choice questions, true, false, long and short questions on a specific topic. So let's do that. So I'm generating a quiz on the topic of of recycling so let's generate it it will generate some questions make sure that you review the questions in order to ensure the accuracy of questions and given options once you are done with that so the next thing is we need to transform these questions into the google form quiz format so how are we going to do that so this will be your prompt generate a google form script to create a quiz using these questions right so i will click here and it will start doing the magic. If you see it is generating code, we don't have to be worried about this code. We just need to focus on the final outcome. All right, so we have got the code. So we will copy this code, create a folder in Google Drive where you want to create that Google form quiz. Right click, form, blank quiz. Once we are on this form, we need to click on three dotted option. We need to go to the script editor. We need to remove any existing code and we need to paste the code that we have copied from chat GPT. Allow. We have got all the code here. Now the next thing is we need to save this code. And once it is saved, you will see this run button has become live. So we need to click on it. Click on review permissions. You need to select the account that is connected to your Google form or Google Drive. We are done with the authorization. Execution of the code has started. I mean, we don't have to do anything. We don't have to copy paste the stuff. Execution is done. One thing I forgot to tell you that you can rename your Google Forms, for example, recycling quiz, and then we can rename it. All right, now we need to go back to our Google Drive and we need to click on recent. And then you can see the recycling quiz if we double click on it. And here you go with all the questions, the multiple choice questions, true, false, short questions and a long question. So you can see this is how you can generate a Google form quiz within few clicks without you being copying and pasting all the content from chat GPT into the Google form. I hope you find this video helpful and useful. Like the video, subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for more informative videos on teaching and learning abroad and these types of quick teaching tips. Thank you.